Hi everyone, in the video today we looked at shipping in the South End area from the evening of the 26th of July 2022. In the foreground we see Sea Shannon anchored up in the Lee Small Ships anchorage. In the background we see the rural cargo ship Vesper team sailing down the river from Perfleet to Rotterdam. Vespertin was built in 2010 and sails under the flag of Malta. Our home port is Valletta. She is 196 metres long, 26 metres wide and has a draft of 6.4 metres. As Vespertine continues downriver, we now see her pass the Sea Reach 4 buoys. We now see Vespertine passing South End Pier. The building you see in the middle of the screen is the South End RNLI lifeboat station. We now see the passenger ship Silver Whisper heading up the river to Greenwich. Note the South End Pier train in the foreground. Silver Whisper was built in 2001 and sails under the flag of the Bahamas. Her home port is Nassau. She is 186 metres long, 25 metres wide and has a draft of 6.2 metres. In the background we see container ship A to B Future on a sailing from Thames Port. Silver Whisper is operated by Silver Sea Cruises. She was built in Genoa in Italy and has a top speed of 21 knots. She has 10 decks of which 7 are passenger decks and can accommodate 392 passengers and 302 crew.
Coming up the river at the same time is the rural cargo ship Yasmin on a sailing from Zeebrugge to her fleet. Yasmin was built in 2007 and sails under the flag of Malta. Her home port is Valletta. She is 203 metres long, 31 metres wide and has a draft of 7 metres. Coming down the river at the same time, we have the rural cargo ship Alf Pollock on a sailing from Perfleet to Zeebrugge in Belgium. Here we see Yasmin and Alf Pollock passing each other. Alf Pollock was built in 2018 and sails under the flag of Italy. You can also see the green, white and red stripes on the side of the ship. Her home port is Cagliari. Sailing up to the London International Cruise Terminal at Tilbury, we now see the passenger ship Aegean Odyssey. Aegean Odyssey was built in 1973 and sails under the flag of Panama. She is 141 metres long, 21 metres wide and has a draft of 6.5 metres. Silver Whisper has now moved further upriver and we see her passing Sea Shannon in the anchorage. Aegean Odyssey was built in Romania. She has eight decks, seven of which are accessible to passengers. She can accommodate up to 380 passengers and 180 crew. We now see Aegean Odyssey and Alf Pollock passing each other. If you are enjoying the video, please remember to click the like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more videos in the future. Here we see Alf Pollock passing the South End Pier. By now it was beginning to rain quite heavily and visibility was steadily decreasing. As we come to the end of the video, I would like to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to click the thumbs up button 
and consider subscribing to the channel for more videos in the future.